Hey guys, uh, Jerry, today's Thursday. So yesterday I talked about Corey being like Coach Corey and bringing in new people, and we're talking about personal growth and development, but personal growth and development as it relates to like um, employee retention as well. Like one of our strategies at Alluring Glass is, uh, one of the things we think is that if we add ingredients to our uh, methodology, so if Coach Corey onboards guys and helps, personally and professionally grow them, it might lend itself to um, more retention. And so I think it's pretty interesting to consider like different recipes, like what are some of the ingredients as business owners, um, and I've had this conversation a bunch recently with business owners, what ingredients do you put into your company? What are the ingredients that you put into your company to try to recruit people and retain people, grow people in our case, right? What are the ingredients? So for lunch today, I'm not gonna eat all of this, Connor, but for lunch today, the ingredients are, I'm gonna put some spinach in there. It's a lot of spinach. Uh, I'm gonna put some walnuts in there, the ingredients. I got some, uh, some feta, some feta crumbs I'm gonna put in there. I forgot the cranberry. There's little, what do they call those things? Craisins, I forgot those. Dang it. And then I'm gonna use, uh, raspberry walnut vinaigrette, right? That, those are the ingredients to make my salad today. And I forgot the craisins, dang it. Anyway, those are the ingredients for my salad today. What are the ingredients for your company, right? So as, a, as an owner that's trying to recruit people, what are some of the ingredients that are gonna draw dream employees to you? And then when you get dream employees, going back to Coach yesterday, Coach Corey, is what are some of the ingredients that Corey's going to apply that we think will, so he was working with Kevin this morning. Kevin's a high school student. What are some of the ingredients that Corey, the coach, is putting into, right, the puzzle, if you will, into the culture that's going to help grow and hopefully retain Kevin? What are some of those ingredients? And we think personal growth is one of them. Like, I think, I think the, the state of the uh, labor market is forcing a lot of leaders and owners to innovate and try to figure out what ingredients do I need to put in there? Obviously pay, benefits, there's some obvious ones, right? The low hanging fruit, pay, benefits, culture, like are guys nice to each other? Do they serve each other? What are some other ingredients? And you know, I don't think there's a silver bullet. I don't think there's a perfect recipe, but I think what we have to do as owners is we gotta figure out what recipes, like we're cooks, right? In the kitchen, we're, we're putting different ingredients in to see what's going to work and it's gonna change, right? It's fluid, the, the job market is fluid with inflation. I think a bunch of things are changing. So as owners, we gotta pay attention to this. So again, the message is for today as, as it relates to personal growth, what ingredients are you putting into your business as it relates to personal growth for the hope of retention?